Another day, another drama, baby. This is what we do, and I enjoy it. So we have a woman who apparently is going to give a wild excuse when she gets pulled over by police. I don't know what that is, so let's uh, let's dive in and not waste any time. I am about to record him, and I'm showing him in court. You're racist, and he been you're, racist. You're already on, the, you're on video, too, okay, so go and step aside. Been racist All right, let's get out here, guys. Let's get out. Driving. When you pulled that little stunt over there, how you cut everybody off and accelerate like a, like a crazy person? I wasn't. Ma'am, just, just traffic <laughs> heavy here. There's no need for that. That's caused accidents. So I need your license. Okay, what's the what's the Because your driving's horrible. There's no need for it. You could have caused two or three accidents. No, I was driving so I wouldn't cause no accidents. No, you were driving aggressively. I was getting away from the traffic because you they, know were what? Going, they wasn't even going There's to bumper speed. to bumper traffic at 91 at this hour. You should not be driving that way. You were so lucky that you didn't cause an accident. No, I wasn't doing 91. And then the lady was, wasn't even doing the speed limit that I was behind, so I went beside Do you know her. what the speed limit is right here? It's not what she was doing. She What's was doing the speed limit here? No, it's 25. Oh. Okay, that's a license. I don't have one. You don't have insurance? I do have insurance. I said I don't have my insurance card with me. Okay. So. Can you bring it up on your phone or no? Come out of the car for me, please. I like how she... she so, I'm pretty sure she, they're on like a, a normal town roads, right? It's just one lane going each way. She's like, well, she wasn't going the speed limit, so I went up beside... Like, the way that she explained it tried to make it sound like she didn't actually break the law, but that, that's it's interesting. She's like, no, I was I was going away from the traffic. Yeah, I was just... I was getting out of there. I need you to yeah. step out of the car. <laughs> oh, yeah, boy. No, Your license is suspended. Okay, my license is I just made a payment. It's not... Well, and then we go by the computer, and the computer is suspended. Do you have any paperwork on you? So anyway, I need you to step out of the car. Because I asked you. So please step out of the car. Step out of the car. Ma'am, step out of the car. Well, ma'am, but we saw you have to follow his orders and step out and we'll talk about it back in his vehicle, okay? And we're going to go back here because we don't want to. You're not under arrest right now. We're just going to come back to this way. Come on out of the car. we got paperwork to do. So you, you can argue a little bit that he was maybe not super professional in the way that he approached it, where he's just like, yeah, when you did that little thing back there and, and sped up like a crazy person. I mean, yeah, it, it maybe wasn't necessary to use some of the terms and words that he did. But at the same time, when someone sees you put other people's lives at risk, some people don't take that very lightly and they are going to be a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not like he called names or was like, get out of the car ah, like anything like that. He just was kind of like giving it back a little. Yeah, I don't know. I, I don't really take it as being that negative, but I, I can kind of understand where she's coming from with that. Regardless, you, you you broke the law. Let's just get it over with. All right, leave your purse there for me. All right, you don't have anything on you? No weapons, anything like that? No. Okay, we're going to put you in the back of the car. You're going to come back in the back of my ear? No, the police car. You have nothing yeah. on you? What's in your pocket right there? In your right pocket? See, okay, here we go. This is a problem, okay? Let us please address. Oh, my goodness, I can't stand. I knew this was going to happen. As soon as she got out and he asked her about if there's anything on her weapons or whatever, I knew the look on her face was going to lead to this right here. So this is a normal question. This is normal. I, 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 we watch a ton of police videos. A lot of time, anytime they take somebody out of the car, as they're going to pat their pockets down, they ask them. Because if you are open about it, because here's the thing, right? If they're like, hey, do you have anything sharp on you? And you say no. And then as they pat you down, they find something. They, they know that you're not very trustworthy. You've already lied to them once. Like there's reasons for some of these questions and stuff. They're not asking it just because you're black. Don't, don't paint that picture. This is, this is, this is a big part of the problem. Because we're, we're, we're painting things as being a certain way when it's not, and it's taking the attention away. It's like the people that are like, oh, my God, I got taken advantage, when you really didn't. You just you chose to do something, and then you changed your mind afterwards, whereas there's actually women out there that are being taken advantage of, right? And so you're, you're taking away from, from that by, by doing this. This is the same thing. The black There are people that actually are being, uh, you know, done dirty because of a... a, a a horrible cop or a, a person, you know, whatever the case is, I'm trying to avoid certain words because I never know what YouTube is going to trigger. But you know what I'm saying? Someone that doesn't like us, 
It, it happens. But this is not one of those situations. And, and, and by trying to make it that, you're taking away from the real things, the things that happen. I just, this is going to make me mad. I already know it. I can't wait to All right, we're done here. We're done here, guys. Go. Uh, we're done here. You're done here. Stay, okay, away this is my car. Stay away from the car. Stay away from the car. Stay away from the car. Okay, I was getting Joe, get in your truck and go. Why get in your truck and go. That is so racist. Y'all oh, is so racist. Oh, everything's racist. Yeah, it is. Yeah, that's, that's, that's all do. it is. That's that's all, a, it's only excuse you got. That is what The fact that you don't have a driver's license. I do have a driver's license. I do have a driver's license. It has nothing to do with anything. It's our fault, right? And he didn't give me my insurance. Where's my um? Where's my driver's license at? That's, that's going to be it to the court. Oh, no. Well, now oh, yeah. you're taking my driver's license. That's... See, I, oh, my God, this lady's killing me. Everything's racist. Yes, if your license is suspended and you still have it on you and you get pulled over using it illegally trying to drive, they will tend take your license. That's, this is not, it's not because you're black. I promise you. It's just, this is, this happens. Maybe it's different depending on each state. I don't know. Uh, also, if you don't have insurance and stuff, guess what? Like, they, they might tow your car. They, you might get a ticket. This is normal. Again, it's not because you're black. I promise you. It's not because you're black. Like, oh my God. Now, I don't know why he's not allowing her to touch her car. I don't know if that's a real thing or not. I always assumed that you could still get whatever you need out of your car, but I, I've never been in this situation personally, not like legally having to have it towed, so I don't really know. Someone could comment below and let me know more if uh, you've been in this situation. Why would you take my driver's Property of State of Ohio. I, I never in my life had to go through this with nobody Property of State of Ohio. So why is it Property of State of Ohio? Because I never it's suspended. got my driver license took It's suspended. In. But I never got them took in. Okay, ever. that doesn't you mean. Know, if they was poor, they, they should have, though. If you don't want to do it the right way, but doesn't no, mean we're not. It's not the right way. Y'all just racist as fuck. Okay, all right, we're out of here. You know what? We're done. What are you doing? You're not getting in the car. You're not getting in the car. Get away from the car. Don't tell me to get away from the car. Get away from the car. Like I said, shut up. No, you shut up. No, you shut up. No, I'm not going to. Do something. Get away from the car. She's literally she she wants something to happen at this point She's just looking for something so that she could go online and be like look what this cop did to me. Oh my god That's a hundred percent what she's looking for right now, and this is this is horrible. This is this is <laughs> yeah, listen As a black community we got to start to call these kind of people out We've got to correct from within because it's the only way things are gonna change Do something. Do something. Do something. Get away from the car. Get I want my driver like that. That's Okay. No, I am about to record them, and I'm showing them in court. You're racist, and he's you're, been you're already racist. on the you're on video too. Okay. So go and step he's aside. Been racist All right, let's get out of here, guys. Let's get out. Away from the vehicle. Get out of the roadway. Hey. What's up, me? Stop. Stop. Hey. See, this is, this is, you, I'm going to be honest with you. I feel like you deserved it at this point. Like you're standing in the road by their car. So what do they, they go to drive off. Then what? You put your, your foot under the tire or you try to do something like, and so they're not going to risk it. So they're like, you just get out of there and you're not like, at some point you, something's got to be done. I'm, I'm so sick of people feeling like, well, no, I could just do whatever I want. You can't touch me. You can't. Blah, 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 blah. This, that, and the third, it's like, yo, society got a lot of y'all feeling real, real comfortable anymore. Like, at the end of the day, this is all works this way because we've set it up this way. Otherwise, we would be animalistic and y'all would just be getting eaten out here. I swear to God, people are stupid. People are stupid. I just, I can't. I can't with people. I can't with people. Everything, it, it, America's turned weird. This whole, like, bro, I, I'm, I'm so free that I could just do anything. I could disrespect you. I could I could break laws. I could, because I'm free. And if you don't let me do that, you're, you're in you're, you're imposing on my freedom and you're racist or you're this or you're that. Come on, people, please. Yeah, this makes me so, I'm so turned off by life when I see stuff like this. Hey, I didn't do anything. See, I'm, I'm not doing anything. I'm not. Why are you not touching me? This officer move his car after you pull the feet on the road. I'm not doing anything. Get away from the car. I'm not doing anything. It's obstruction okay. and assault on a police officer. Oh, my head is in the grass. This is so Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. My, I got to stop having my alarm. Every video, every, one video of five every day, you guys will hear an alarm go off. I've got to stop. I've got to fix it. I got to figure this out. Jeez. Don't you mean racist? Yes. I didn't punch you. I promise I didn't punch you. But I, I promise I didn't punch you. I wasn't resisting. Huh? Okay. I'm going to stand you up. Ready? One, two, three. Okay, that's my thing. Then all of a sudden she's calm at the very end. It's like, what just happened?
She said, he's like, you punch you. No, oh, you know, I promise I didn't punch you. I'm not resisting. I'm good. That just, that went in a way that it didn't have to go. That went in a way that it did not have to go. Ah, it's like, this. they're going to tow your car. What I, it sucks, right? It sucks. They're going to take your license because that is what they do. It has nothing to do with you being black. It sucks. What you do in this situation is you just reevaluate your life choices. It's like, oh, wow. I shouldn't have tried to drive the car without the license, without the insurance. Shouldn't have put myself in this situation. This is going to set me back. It's super unfortunate. But the last thing I need to do is do more things to set me back even further. Now let me try to figure out how I'm going to go forward from here. That's what we've got to do. It's not always the most fun. It's not a great situation. Yes, maybe you needed to go somewhere really bad and you thought I could sneak and get away with it. But you didn't. You took the risk and you knew it when you took it. And, and, and it didn't go in your favor. Don't get mad about that. Don't get mad about that. I don't know. Comment below. Let me know what you guys think. I appreciate you. I'll catch you next video, homies.